In other local stories, Secretary of the Public Representation Committee on Constitutional Reforms, Winston Pathiraja, emphasizes that the proposed constitution has been undergoing a process of reforms over the past two years. Addressing an awareness program for the army personnel on the proposed constitution, he went on to say that recent criticism over the alleged lack of time given to make necessary decisions on the constitution is unreasonable. The awareness program for army personnel on the proposed constitution was held at the auditorium of the Army Hospital in Nara Henpitu today. Addressing the gathering, additional secretary of the Constitutional Assembly, Uresha Fernando, explained the main reason behind attempts to establish a new constitution. So the constitution we have is one that has the needs and aspirations of the people who, who were there in 1978. The changing political, social, economic, cultural even factors will make it necessary to have a new constitution. So now we are looking at the needs and aspirations of the current Sri Lankan people who are living in the present generation. Meanwhile, Secretary of the Public Representation Committee on Constitutional Reforms, Winston Patiraja, emphasized that the proposed constitution was given due to process of public consultation. The proposed new constitution has been going through a process of reform, commencing from a resolution having been passed in Parliament unanimously in March 2016, outlining the process of the proposed constitutional reform. What I want to stress here is that some people say that all of a sudden we are starting some constitutional reform and we are trying to pass it. But it is not so. In 2015 we started, now it is 2017. So for the two years it has been going through various processes. Unlike the way in which the past three constitutions were enacted, the proposed new constitution is given due process of public consultation. The first phase of the program was over. We are now on the, in the process of starting the second phase of program that is only for the civil society. 